Hey guys, what's up? I'm back. I figured this time we'd do a quick unboxing of something I got in the mail today that I think you'll like a lot. Of course, this is something we're going to be reviewing at some point. I mean, you know, that's the whole point of having it where it is. It's going to be reviewed probably in the next week or so, given the fact that a couple of bigger projects I'm working on right now, but so far this, this should be a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and get this open, shall we? My first thing off the bat that I'm wondering is why we have such a huge box. Something that's essentially rather small. I don't understand this personally, but I mean, I'm glad it's protected, so that's definitely good. Okay, let's take a look. So I've got my packing information. Let me do that off camera for you all. Oh, I got a little postcard too. Wasn't that nice? Yeah, that's cool. I'll read that all off camera. Awful lot of packaging material for what is essentially a small figure. Yeah, I mean, it's not too bad. Is anything else in here? Nope. Okay, well, that's to be expected. I'm glad they packaged it so well. That's that's a good thing. Yeah, let me crack open the bubble wrap here and Nothing nice that companies have learned that people pay a premium price tag for a figure you check it well. Definitely a nice thing. Yeah, okay. Oh, it's wrapped up quite well. Definitely not bad. Pretty good. I know this is rather different for the channel since generally we don't buy figures that much. Especially articulated figures at that. I mean, you know, most of the figures we do wind up buying and reviewing generally are statues or like in our Zorro video was a knockoff being compared to the official thing, but I mean, variable action heroes is also an old line. This, on the other hand, is a surprisingly very good line, but also the fact that, well, I'm a fan of Naruto. I like Kakashi quite a bit. But you guys didn't know that. You thought it was just Bleach in One Piece, didn't you? But, yeah, I mean, Kakashi is one of my favorite characters from Naruto. He's a fantastic character. So... When I heard this figure arts was coming out, I knew that I was going to buy it one way or another. And considering that the website I bought this off of was surprisingly very cheap, if you sign up for their premium subscription, I was able to snag this figure for $32. $40 after shipping. Very good deal for what's probably one of the best figure arts we've had in about a decade. Now, of course, I'm going to take some time Look at the figure on my own, get it out of the package, take a look at everything, but I'll definitely review this at its fullest. Of course, that's because I really like the character, so of course I'm going to review it to its 
full level of what it deserves, but yeah, I mean, good packaging too. You've got full art of the figure there, the standard blurb on the back for figure arts, standard blurb on the side. I'm assuming that's Kakashi's name in Japanese. I'm not too good at Japanese, but... And then you've got everything right there. So, I mean... It's about what you expect for modern figure arts. And the way modern figure arts are packaged, but... Yeah, I mean, it's a good figure. It looks good. Everything looks the way it should. Nice matte finish. Looks like he's about the same size as... The anime heroes figure, so that's good. He should scale pretty well. So that's pretty good. Yeah, I mean, look forward to this in the next week of getting a review of him. So, yeah, I may actually unbox the figure for you guys too, if you want that. If not, then obviously we don't have to do that, but I figured you guys would like something a little different. Hopefully this mic setup works. I don't really want to have to record all this audio. So, yeah. We'll be getting a review of this guy in the coming weeks. See y'all later.